Guys, it's Mr. TJ Taylor one again. I'm just gonna do a quick video. As you can see, I'm now gonna painted the back end of my Atco 732 Ron tractor. I've gone for the lighter colour scheme, but with this green, I've gone with this yellow. So let's just have a look at the two together. And they go quite well, they contrast, but what I, this colour scheme that I'm going to go with now, I finalised my decision, is with the John Deere colour scheme. So, we a lot more videos to come. I've still got, to, I'm going to get some ha paint on, brush paint, to go around the gear, stick, you know, the little nook and crannies in between all the different letters. Come round this side, you can see it's the same. Another little news is the engine still ain't running. I think I might have to do a re whole engine rebuild and maybe a few new parts added onto it. But as you can see, this is a Briggs and Stratton four cycle engine, seven horsepower. But I'm what I'm what I'm thinking is to go from a 7 horsepower engine on this Atco 732 all the way up to a 12.5 horsepower engine which will kick out a lot more of a punch but at the same time that is a fully working engine that I can get for quite cheap so another thing is this bar here I repainted one of them it came out quite well and another thing is Mud guards over here. Gave them a quick coat of silver paint, but I wouldn't go and put them on the tractor that colour. I'd want them with that green, but on the tractor, that silver I'll just show you. Let's see which side this goes on the left. Put that on the ground a sec. Is, as you can see that silver doesn't go as well as you think it would but at the same time it could work if I looked into it and got give a bit of better of a, better of a coating on it it might work but I'll just have to find out so let's see another small episode of the restoration of the Atco 732 tractor so thanks for